Now for the last part of the question then, we've got to sketch the graph of R against T. So we'll just draw our axes like so. We'd have T here and R here. Now we know that when T was naught, R was equal to a thousand. So we could mark in that, we'll imagine that point there is a thousand. So put that up there. Now we have a negative exponential graph, exponential decay. And we should know that as t gets larger, this quantity here tends to zero. Zero times a thousand would be zero. We have a graph then that's going to come down quite rapidly at first and then slowly tail off something like this. Okay? towards the t-axis. So there is a sketch of your graph.